My name is Sean Higgins and today we're going to be talking all about Tarakihi. So, Tarakihi, Tarakihi if you're from the south, or turkeys for slang, are a species of fish found all throughout New Zealand's coastline. But they are most common through Wellington, the Marlborough Sounds and in the deep south around Stewart Island and through the fjords. In these areas you're going to find them quite shallow. I've seen them as shallow as 2 to 3 metres, but more commonly 4 to 5 out to around 20 metres. Down the east and west coast you're going to find them quite a bit deeper, sort of 15 metres plus. They're not particularly seasonal, I find you can get them all year round, but summer they seem to be in greater numbers in the shallows. This is quite a typical situation for the top of the South Island. Green water off the side of a rocky kelp bed at around 7 to 8 metres, with schools of fish ranging from 3 to 4 up to 500 or more. So here I'm not displaying very good technique. Bombing down straight on top of the fish is often not the best way to go, but in this dirty green water, I managed to get away with it. These fish have a very soft flesh, so gut shots or shooting too high like I've done here often don't end well. Tarakihi aren't that hard to shoot they can be a wee bit skittish and a wee bit timid, so having good bottom time and making slow movements will definitely help. Next up, this is probably my favourite method for shooting Tarakihi. I find a spot that looks like it's going to be holding fish, and start making dives to the bottom just lying perfectly flat and trying not to move. The fish are very curious and they'll generally come right in close to check you out. You're usually going to find Tarakihi around structure, where there's a bit of rock and a bit of weed that sort of cascades down into sand, gravel or mud. You'll notice that at first there's quite a large school, but as I start shooting fish, they slowly start disappearing. As a rule of thumb, I usually say they'll hang around for 30 minutes before moving on to another spot. Tarakihi are one of New Zealand's favourite eating fish. They're most commonly found between 30 and 40 centimetres, with the legal limit being 25 centimetres, but between 25 and 30 they're really not worth taking as the fillets are quite small. Alright, so now we know where we're going to find a Tarakihi and how we're going to approach them, but one of the most common mistakes is misidentifying them for a juvenile blue moki. So these fish are very similar looking and both swim around in schools. But the thing that's going to help you identify a tarakihi the easiest is the black band over its head and the longer pectoral fins. In dirty water you'll often only see the black band over the head, but in clean water you'll be able to see both of these features. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and learned something new. If you haven't already subscribed, feel free to do so and I'll see you back on the next one.